cheerful people. Today we're just going to be doing a get ready with me video since I haven't done one in forever. Yeah. Alright guys, so I hope you guys are doing well. Um, as I was saying, we're just going to do a get ready with me video since I know I haven't done one in forever. And I am super duper obsessed with the new season of Riverdale that was just uploaded to Netflix. Just finished binge watching the first two seasons. I'm like four episodes into season three. So I'm thinking about doing yellow and blue makeup today. And yeah, just getting dressed and having fun with makeup and seeing how everyone's doing. And yeah. I'm going to stop being creepy or try to stop being creepy. And um, I'm going to start off with doing like a nude lip using the Fenty Beauty paint, lip paint in uh, unbutton. So yeah, just going to start applying that shit to my face, you know. It's been a long week. I know it was a holiday week and I only worked and I was off Monday, but it's been a long week. So clearly I already did like my foundation, like put on bronzer, filled in my eyebrows and stuff. So that way I wouldn't be like adding a huge ridiculously long video. And that way you guys can get past like the boring stuff and just look at the lips and the eyes and what you're probably here for. So yeah. Okay, I'm gonna, I know I said I stopped being creepy. I'm trying, okay? And then I'll be right back. I'm probably gonna use the James Charles palette. I know about all the tea and all the craziness going on with him but it's a really pretty palette and I'm gonna use it anyway I spent money on it and it has a lot of really bright colors and regardless of what's going on I'm gonna use it because it's Morphe and Morphe makeup is the bomb alright so before we could put on the eyeshadow makeup you know I had to put on some eyeshadow primer today we used the Urban Decay eyeshadow primer potion just because I'm trying to get rid of some of the stuff I have and I know I have of like five different eyeshadow primers I don't know why I just do so yeah I'm trying to like slowly use some of my stuff so I've been trying to stick to like because I had a whole bunch of foundations too I threw out some ones that I've had for too long are kind of going bad I'm trying to make sure to use like the same two or three to kind of get rid of them so I can stick to the newer stuff that I have later on and trying to get rid of some of my like, highlighters, bronzer stuff, just trying to declutter basically. But yeah, I have the beautiful James Charles palette here and it is, I saw the plastic in there, but yeah, look at all these beautiful colors and the yellows and the blue and hello to this beautiful blue. I am so excited to use it, so let's get started. So for today's look, I'm just going to start off by brushing this light cream color across my whole eyelid called Canvas with a really cute little brush, a big old fluffy brush, just across the whole eyelid. I know it's the same color as me, but you know, it's nice to have a nice base. Do it to both eyes. I'll be right back. I'm going to do the other one off camera. Okay, so that really super pretty bright blue color I pointed out at the beginning of the video is called Playground. I have that here on my brush, and I'm just going to start adding it here in the crease or in the corner and work my way up into the crease and just make like a really pretty blue color across the whole top part of my eyelid. And then just blend that shit out as much as possible. I'm going to extend it down a little bit here to the bottom as well. And then I'm going to do the same side to the other eye. Well, this side of my face. You know what I mean. Okay, then I'm going to take this really pretty dark blue color. For some reason, it is called Cola on this brush. And I'm going to go ahead and kind of darken the crease just a little bit with this darker color. Literally just go from the corner and follow along the crease really thinly. So how it has the dark, lighter color and then have a little bit of the darker color in here. And yeah.
Now I'm gonna go do the other side. I'll be right back, guys. Sorry, I, I know like some people get annoyed to just doing one side or the other. I just don't want these videos to be super crazy long. Just want it to be like, this is what you gotta do and then go just move on with your day. You can finish watching this, get this look. It's all, it should just be about the makeup, guys. Okay, so I have this really bright, pretty yellow color on here called B. Um, but before I do that, I'm gonna go ahead and take this um, concealer stick from Wet n Wild with a brush. It kind of looks like a little eyebrow brush. And um, use that to go ahead and cut out a crease here in the shadow just so that it also has something to stick to to really make this yellow pop. And we're just gonna apply this here. And just give ourselves a really defined crease and shape. And then I gotta do that to the other eye and then add the yellow over it. So I will be right back. But see, like it really makes a huge difference. And then since it's still kind of wet or cream base, the powder, you can just pack that on there like nobody's business. Okay, so now that I have the concealer in both eyes, I'm gonna take this little flat or small brush that um, to this really pretty yellow, the B color. That way I can just pack this here on that eyelid so I can get a really bright, beautiful yellow color. Look at how beautiful and bright that yellow is coming out. And then just kind of blend it out into the blue. See? It's so beautiful and then you can see the really dark part of the blue and then the light color as it blends out. So I'll be right back. I gotta finish up the yellow on the other eye as well. So I'll be right back. Okay, now that I got that on here, I'm also gonna take this little tiny round pointed brush into this really pretty like highlighter color called Ring Light. Um, just to add a little bit of a highlight still into the corner right here of my eye. I have a little bit of the yellow there, but just to kind of make it stand out a little bit more for the tear ducts highlight and blend that out. So it adds a little bit of a highlight right there. And then we'll just do it on both sides and then I'll come back with the same brush. I'm gonna use it to add a little bit of a color down here along with the blue. Um, yeah, so yeah, give me one moment. Okay, so I clean up the, oh my goodness, I'm so sorry for shaking you guys again. Um, but we're gonna take, go ahead and take that same brush into like this orangey yellow color. I like to call it the Cheeto color. And we're just gonna lightly dust the brush with it. And then I'm just gonna add a little bit of this here underneath from the blue into the little bit of the middle part of my eye to kind of help complement that yellow and that blue. And just to add a little bit of beautiful color down here too. And then I'm gonna go ahead and add my wing eyeliner as well off camera and I'll be right back and then yeah I'll see you guys in a minute. Alright guys so that's my yellow and blue makeup look. Eyeliner and mascara done. That's it. Yep. So I hope you guys enjoyed this getting ready with me video. I'm going to go put on some real clothes and a bra and look like not a hobo with this beautiful makeup on. So um, I'll see you guys later. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If there's certain colors or looks you want to see me do something with that palette or any of the palettes you know I have, let me know down in the comments. Or if you have a certain color combination you love using the Jeffree Star palette, let me know. And as always, I'll talk to you later. Bye. Oh yeah, don't forget to like and subscribe. Yeah, down there on the video buttons on the side too. But yeah, bye guys. I'll see you later on the next video. Hey guys, so here's the finished look. Wing eyeliner and mascara on and done. I hope you guys enjoyed getting ready with me today, doing this beautiful makeup look. I love this yellow and this blue. Um, if there's any certain colors you want to see with the James Charles palette, or if you have a certain favorite color you like combo, let me know. Maybe I'll try it out or do a look myself with it. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm going to go get dressed, you know, put on some um, better clothes and probably a bra and something beautiful to match this beautiful makeup. 
and um, I hope you guys are having a beautiful day. Don't forget to like and like. Give me that thumbs up and subscribe with the buttons on either side or down there, whatever. And um, I'll have a beautiful day. And I'll talk to you later. See you in the next video. Bye.